I remember the day that I first met Lisa. It was when I was just starting my placement at Lintonville GP Surgery. And during my induction, I was spending a bit of time with all the different members of the team. And on that morning, I was sitting in on the district nurses clinic. So I remember I knocked on the door, introduced myself, and I could tell from the look on her face that she was thinking, why is it me who's ended up with a person sitting in with them? <laughs> <laughs> so she told me to sit on the chair in the corner, and I don't think I said another word to the rest of the clinic. <laughs> For the rest of the time at Lintonville, I didn't see too much of Lisa, mainly because I was too scared to ever really set foot in the district nursing office. <laughs> well, good afternoon, everybody. So, on behalf of the staff and management here at Charlton Hall and the Northumberland Registration Service, I'd like to welcome you here today for the ceremony of Ross and Lisa. But it was after I'd finished on my placement that we got talking and decided to meet up and it didn't take me long to see how amazing she is. And within just a few months, we were already talking about getting our house together. I remember the moment that I decided to ask Lisa to marry me. I was going traveling for six weeks and I remember being sat on the plane on the way to Thailand. And my only thought was, how am I gonna get through the next six weeks without seeing Lisa? And I knew at that moment that if I couldn't get through six weeks without her, then I definitely couldn't spend the rest of my life without her. Lisa, I choose you above all others. I promise to stand with you as we share this life and cherish the memories we have. And I will honour this pledge for as long as I live. Ross, I stand by you happy and proud of the special love we have shared. Today we celebrate all that lies ahead. I promise to love you, cherish and respect you. I pledge to you faithfulness and friendship in good times and bad, whatever the future may bring. So Ross and Lisa, every day you live, remember the promises that you've made to each other today. Continue to live your lives as best friends and strive to fulfill each other's happiness. Therefore, gives me the greatest of pleasures to see Ross and Lisa. You've probably declared your love for each other, and you say, "May kiss your beautiful bride." We've already had so many great experiences together, <coughs> traveling to all different parts of the world and have an amazing life at home with our dog, two cats and two chickens. I'm pretty sure Lisa's secretly trying to start a zoo without telling me. <laughs> but I'm even more excited about what happens next, especially in January when we'll have our own little baby girl. Aww. Lisa, thank you for giving me everything that I could ever ask for in life and so much more. And I just hope that I can give you everything that you deserve. So I'd like you all to raise a glass to my wonderful wife, Lisa. Woo!